Hey, welcome back, guys. Hey, you're probably wondering why I'm down here, right? Well, I was looking at some designs for a nice door. And I, I came upon this ethel door, which most people probably know. It, probably not. It's basically a, a two-tick door, but it has eight pistons, and it, it does, like, this entire hole. It just... You can literally run through the door in the piston door. And I noticed I didn't have any snowball slime balls. So I went on his website and I researched to get um, 1.9 and 1.10 um, chunk slime ball slime chunks. And it was right near my base. It was one literally right next to my base. So I just dug down and just dug this entire chunk. If you don't know how I measure chunks, if you see right here the 15 15 15 that is the corner of a chunk and if it says 0 15 15 that means another corner and 0 15 0 is another corner and 15 15 0 is another corner 15 is just a chunk because if I go if I go here see how that turns to 0 that means the start of another chunk because it turns from 15 right here to zero. So that's how I know it's one chunk. That is where this place is. My pick is about to run out. How much do I really have? 42. Damn. I need more diamonds. This is my last diamond pick I have. I'm just trying to buy this place out so I can get some slime balls for some sticky pistons. I already have the iron. I already have the redstone. I just need some sticky pistons. I'll get you guys back once I have some progress in this place and get these people over here. I'll be right back. Hey, this is currently the next day, so sorry about the cutoff recording there, but currently the next day, I was a little bit sick last night, so I couldn't record much, but I'm back at it, and yeah, let's just get right to it. Uh, sorry that the microphone was off a little bit there. I was almost dying, and I kind of made myself a little cubby hole, and alright, good, did he spawn? But... In my sickness, I found something awesome. I don't need any more gold. I found this skeleton spawner, and which is actually really, really close to my base. It was literally like about, it's less than 100 bucks from my base. Look at this. Oh yeah, I made this just in case someone found it. But yeah, this is awesome. I found some awesome loot in here. I found saddle, two music disc, a golden apple. And yeah, a notch apple actually, and a couple diamonds. I loved it. Actually, yesterday I even got super, super lucky. I wish I could record it. I got like a stack of diamonds in less than an hour. It was freaking amazing. But I'm going to try to connect this to my base. I think my base is that way, about 50 blocks. So I'm going to try... Actually, hmm. I'm going to try to get something cooking here so I can get this close to my base. I'm uh I'm actually gonna be right back. I'm gonna see if this is even possible to connect my, up my base to this. Alright, I should almost be there. I had to run back like ten or four times. Let's see if this <gasps> No way. Oh dude, this is perfect. I right, I changed what the area is because I looked at the coordinates of my base over here and this is actually where I wanted to get to come out. I might have to move this stairwell a little bit, but oh yeah little update on my base here, I made a 3x3 piston door, which is kind of sneaky, because now when you run in, mobs can't chase you down, except for maybe a zombie, for the little zombie guys, but they're rare. <laughs> and then to close it again on the outside, just a little button, I think it's quite nice, I like it, but about this, this skeleton spawner, I just made a little stairwell over here. It's actually really, really close, which is amazing. Absolutely love it. Look at this. It's right here. I couldn't believe my. I couldn't believe I actually got that. I can't believe this. Oh man! But I'm gonna redesign this area. I believe it's a four, a eight by eight. But I forgot which side is, is smaller because usually three diagonal in one a certain spot and four diagonal on the other side. I'm just going to do a fire diagonal inside. And those are zombies. I'll get back to you when I get that 
8 by 8 around this spot in here. Give me a second. Uh, the only one thing that Minecraft needs to add, and no one's adding it. Inventory space. Like, come on! Craft the bucket. Grab some water. Oh my goodness. Minecraft needs inventory update, like for real. Help 1.11 is better. Okay, so how can I make this so they all flow towards the middle? Yeah, I think I'm gonna do go the one source block method. Or two source block method, I guess. Where I think it's where just two source blocks makes it go into the center. I think it's the fastest way anyways. So what I gotta do is destroy those corner blocks and it should be good. Does this work? Whoa. Yeah, I believe so. Perfect. Well, what are those signs I made? Alright, so what I'm gonna do... Actually, I'm gonna try to separate them from the spawner so more can spawn at a time. Yeah, I'm gonna move the staircase anyway, so I'm gonna push them out. I think at least 16 blocks from the spawner. How far can I get away from the spawner? I think is it 16 blocks? One twitch, two twitch, three twitch, four twitch, and oh, I'm gonna get that one. Like that way. That way. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. No, get away. Oh. Oh. I hear them. I'm guessing it's working. Alright. Sweet. Alright. So I'm gonna gather some XP and try to get some enchants here because I really, really, really need a fortune pick to get more diamonds. Because I really need some gear <laughs> and a lot more redstone because I'm going to do a lot more redstone on here because this is going to I'm going to make this a, a one hit kill um, machine so yeah but great uh, I'm going to move on to the next project which is trying to get trying to expand the farm I'm just going to kill these guys for some XP so what I want to do is try to make I want to move this over one actually because I want to make a wall here to make like a hallway yeah I'm, I want to make a hallway and then it'll be like farms on this side mechanics on this side or storage and I want to make this a storage room actually so I'm gonna get to you once I destroy this and make a hallway more or less and yeah I want to make I want to change these farms to be all independent I'll catch you guys in a little bit once I'm able to make the hallway so I'm working on a little design here. I cleared out the wheat farm that was down the staircase. All the stuff is still here, don't worry. Uh, I'm trying to make it so all the far everything I make is one block down and a couple um, three blocks out. So this would be like a grass patch. And I'm trying to make out a wall design where it includes diorite, even though it's the most horrible block in the world. But the polished one isn't that bad. At least just the the gra I mean, yeah, the granite, the diorite, I don't really, I'm not a fan of, and andesite, it just looks like a really bad version of stone, <laughs> to be honest. So I don't know if I should do that, or I should do this, or let me make another one over here, or if I should do this. Like, I would like it if it didn't have that much spots, if it was a nice white block, yeah. But I don't know. This gives it, and this has like nice, a nice red tone that complements the wood. This one just looks like it's like there's too much structure to it. I don't know something. So there's something about it. I don't like it. Oh, but my plan is to replace this dirt with some grass. I believe Isaac, up in the hill, over by there, is has a ton of grass. I can probably borrow one or two patches of grass. But I'm going to work on this place a little bit more. I'm trying to also put wood on the side so it complements the grass when there, when there will be grass. And 
And yeah, I need to farm some wood in the wake. So. So, there we are. Oh wow, wheat goes really fast in vanilla. Alright, but I'm gonna call episode there, guys. If you really liked it and you liked it in the series, please drop a like and subscribe. I, I, my channel is actually growing pretty nicely. And I believe I really want to do this for a great cause. Like, you know, I, I really want to donate uh, everything we get on the public server to charity and try to just grow it. Um, all the players on here are on the are on the wheel. They're they all like it. They all love what's going on here. They all just want to make it their own. And like they, people have played on here more than they usually would play. Like I brought back some players from basically the dead that they never they haven't played Minecraft in a while. But yeah, I hope you guys like it, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode.